Hello friends, this video on lines and angles part 1 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Topics to be covered in this lesson are Recap of Geometry Basics wherein we'll talk about point, line segment, line and angle. Related angles, complementary angles, supplementary angles, adjacent angles, linear pair and vertically opposite angles. Line pairs, intersecting lines, parallel lines and transversal. Now, we are already aware of the basics of geometry. What is geometry? It is that branch of mathematics that deals with various shapes, their properties and measurements. So in geometry, we talk about different types of shapes. Now, when you talk about different shapes, you see that the objects that you see around yourself, we see a variety of objects like the doors, windows, kite, a pencil, paper, so, so many different things and each of these things, they have a specific shape. Some of them are, you know, uh, circular in shape, some of them are uh, rectangular in shape, some of them, are, they look like a triangle. So each of them has a different or a distinct shape. So we learn more about the shapes, how do we measure these shapes, what are the properties of each of these shapes, that is what we study in geometry. Now, even before we start talking about so many variety of shapes, we talk about the basics of geometry. Now, there are certain basic elements of geometry. So, line and angle, these are also one of those basic elements. So, here in this lesson, we are going to discuss more about lines and angles. Now, before that, let us start with the basic elements of geometry. So, the first basic element of geometry is point. Now, when you look at this clock, you see that the numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and so on, they are represented by points. So, what are points? Points are nothing but dots. It is a geometrical figure which has no width, no length, no dimension at all. So, it is a dimensionless, just a single dot that is called a point. So, the point is the most basic geometrical um, entity, you can say that. The next thing that we talk about is a line or a line segment. Now, when you look at your ruled notebook, so what do you see? You see these straight lines. Now, these lines are basically combination of points like many points put together one after another. It forms a line. So that's a line. Now, again, when we talk about something like a ray, like you, you switch on the torch and what happens? You see that light comes out from the source in a particular direction so these are called rays so this is ray so basically when we talk about line it is a straight lines it is a straight combination of points which extends in both direction when you talk about ray it has a fixed end point at one end and the other end it continues indefinitely like here the source is fixed right so this end is fixed but the other end it keeps on going indefinitely so the other end is not fixed so that's a line and a ray similarly we talk about angles angles are basic geometrical figures and what are these they basically tell us the orientation of one surface with another or orientation of one line with another think of this there's a closed door what happens when you open the door you see what, what's happening here. As soon as you open the door, an angle is formed that sh which shows the orientation of this surface with that of this surface because this boundary or this border of the uh, door is fixed, right? So when you start, try to open the door, it is only this part of the door which opens and as a result, this angle changes. This is angle basically. As you open the door all the more this angle tend to increase so angle is nothing but a geometrical uh, element which shows the orientation of one surface with another or orientation of one line with another so point line line segment rays angles these are the basic elements of geometry we have already learned about them in class six so here we will not spend much time knowing about these again Instead, what we are going to do is we will definitely have a quick recap of each of these and after that we will move on to the different types of pairs of lines, the different types of pairs of angles. 
Thank you. Please visit examfear.com for free quality education. You can learn with a simple four step learning process wherein you can watch video lessons, you can ask your questions, you can refer notes and you can take a free online test. We have content for class 6 to 12 on physics, chemistry, mathematics and biology along with practical videos. So please subscribe to our channel for daily updates. Thank you.